It was really upon coming to Chile, upon coming to Patagonia, that I knew this is the place where I wanted to be. It was the sheer beauty of the country, the spectacular rivers with fantastic fishing in it. But I think even more than that, the fact that there was nobody around. So in your mind you see yourself as a pioneer, you start to romanticize ideas, I can do something that nobody ever has done. So then I came up with the idea to build a fishing lodge. And really, when I was able to buy this beautiful piece of property on the Rio Palena, I really thought, about my base camp program. I can't imagine a better place uh, to, be a, to be a fisherman. It's not uncommon for me to, to float 40 miles of a river over the course of three days and, and not see another person, let alone another fisherman. And, and when you factor in the fishing, it's, it's just, it's an incredible spot because the, you don't see fish behavior uh, other places like you do here. You don't see the, the predatory nature of, of the trout uh, anywhere else that I've ever fished. It's a very visual style of fishing. Well, whether they're taking a streamer or they're eating a dry fly, and because of the boats that we're fishing out of, you can see the takes. The fish will come up to your beetle or to your dragonfly and they'll slowly sip it, which is a really unique part of the fishing here. Each year, I think, okay, I've, I've seen it, I've done it, and this is it. And each following year, I come back. And, you know, I don't come back uh, because I have nothing better to do, I come back because I can't stay away from it. I mean, I, I just love it here. <laughs>